What's up guys, today I'm gonna be playing Sonic the Hedgehog 2, I'm Pim from Barf Gameplay, and I'm going to go up all super Sonic in your ass. Wait. What the fuck? <laughs> Alright, well, I'm not going to play Sonic the Hedgehog 2 and... Wait, I'm wearing a Mario hat. I can play a Mario uh, I can wear a Mario head when I'm playing Sonic. I mean, they just run. Get it? Oh, fuck you, Mario head. Yeah, basically, back in the day, she had like uh, the rivalry between Nintendo and uh, and Sega. And well, I was more of a Sega fan, uh, more of a Sonic fan, to be honest. So, yeah, gonna play Sonic Emerald Hill Zone One. It's the first zone, first zone of the first level. All right, so you gotta get like. Uh, the, co uh, uh, the rings, I want to say coins, but this, that is Mario. But you gotta get those rings uh, so uh, you can't immediately die and stuff. So there's like 10 rings in here. And yeah, you're Sonic, and Sonic is awesome. I actually have this game on the Sega Mega Drive, or what's called Sega Genesis in America and uh, maybe other countries. There was a checkpoint over there. And well, I used to play this game all the time when I was a kid, you know. I mean, I, I finished this game so many times. I can't even remember how many times. It was just so awesome. If my mom played it all the time, and my mom is really totally not a gamer at all. So, yeah, it's just a great game. I mean, it's quite a fast game, and uh, it's easy to play through. There's quite uh, a couple of secrets, like uh, hidden uh, uh, level ups, or I mean, uh, uh, how do you call it, uh, extra characters, yeah, like just on the screen now, there's extra character, because I had so many uh, points or whatever, I don't know exactly how you get those. But yeah, it's a great game, fast paced, just fun to play, and I always hit that guy, I don't know why, but I always hit that guy. Anyway, here's speedy shoes, so you're going to go like supersonic fast, you know, it really run across the stages and just win like BAM like there's nothing uh, nothing really matters just go cause I'm the best ref once Pokemon wait this is not one of my Pokemon episodes this is Sonic alright and now I'm slow again Oop. and now I'm at the boss so the boss is uh, well they call him Eggman most of the time but actually it's called Dr. Robotnik He's an evil uh, doctor thing and he wants to gain control over the world and stuff by kidnapping all kinds of small animals and uh, yeah, that's not really nice to kidnap animals and he turns them into like like ro it was robot minions so they fight for him and yeah, it's quite weird but he's dead, I killed the bastards oh no he's not dead, he's going to fly away with his helicopter so I have to kill him in the next level of course here you see all the, 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 the little uh, little wooden critters, uh, little animals he uh, kidnapped and I freed them and I got through act 2 got another uh, another life because I'm so awesome level 2, zone 1, chemical plant zone uh, this is a really fun one uh, actually the reason I'm playing uh, so that you have two instead of one or three is because I think two is the, the best in the series and a lot of people agree with that Sonic the Hedgehog 2 was really the Sonic game that defined the series I mean a great level designs and just a lot of fun to play this one and it was the first Sonic game that introduced the speed ball thing where you go up in a ball and you go really fast and also it's the first game in which Tails is following you but he never keeps up with me because Sonic is way faster than Tails of course also his real name is Tails Miles Per Hour and Miles Per Hour you know Miles Per Hour you get it you get it awesome joke so funny Miles Per Hour I believe in, uh, in Japan he was only called uh, Miles Per Hour but in America they added tails for some reason because he has tails but and he flies with his tail because he swings his tail around like, like a helicopter and then he flies off um, I don't think you can play as tails in this game but you can in uh, Sonic 3 
and again a new uh, life, so that's always good. Or it might be... A no, it's not a life. Life is in the, the left bottom corner, but uh, I think that this uh, continues. So if you lose all your lives, you get a continue and you can start off with like the first zone in that level or something. So those, those are continues. So I've uh, get it quite a lot of continues already. And here is a life. I remember that one. I will always remember that one. I mean, it's a long time ago I played this game actually. But I will always remember that extra life. Yeah, I really played this game a lot of times. And I used to think it was quite good at this game. I might be a lot worse right now than I used to be when I was young. But I get older and yeah. Anyway, I still like this game a lot more than the, the most modern games. Uh, this is just one of those games that require a bit of skill and knowledge of the, of the layout of the game. And that was one of the reasons it was so awesome. Because if you played it a lot, you would become really great at it. And you didn't have any unfair advantage, like you, you buy just some extra object stuff or you, or you play so many times that you get really awesome weapons. No, it's just all about skill and remembering the layouts of the game. So that's just awesome. No one for a fantasy for any, every, anyone. You just get to know the gameplay a lot and you get good. So yeah. Again, we uh, we lost tails. The tails are slow. <laughs> Alright, this is the part that most people really hate. Because here you can drown because the water is now rising and that's fucking annoying. And if you've ever played this one of the Sonic games, you know how it feels when you drown. It's horrifying to drown in this game and perhaps I will show it to you later. I mean it's really horrifying to drown. But I can show it to you in this level, I'll show it to you in another level where it actually um we can actually walk on the water. Oh, it's really so scary to drown. But you will see, you will see later. If I ever die. Because I'm so awesome. Alright, boss. So where Dr. Robotnik is filling uh, some water or poison in there. In his uh, little bucket. And you sh have to make sure you don't fall through the gaps in the level, on the left and the right side, but he's already dead or destroyed. And now you run away again like the pussy he is. So, freed all the animals again. And yeah, that's awesome. So I'm gonna leave it at this for this episode. I'm gonna make another episode where I go to the next levels and stuff. But I think this is enough for today. So I'm gonna pause it and uh, well the thing is you can't save this game, uh, the old, uh, old school uh, console games you couldn't save them so you have to keep playing. So I have to keep it on pause and then play it afterwards, uh, it's really quite funny. But anyway I hope you liked this video and you can click on uh, the video over down, I keep forgetting what it is but down here is the, is, is the video for, uh, from my, uh, if you click on that you can see my last gameplay video. Otherwise you can click on my face, my beautiful face, you know you like it, to subscribe to my channel. And uh, anyway, I hope you subscribe because of Barf Gameplay, I play games and games play me. Thank you for watching.